This is the only way they have left. And guess what? Four. And it's gonna be gone by the time I finish this. Watch. Because I can count two. And last one. And there you go. Eat the food. And now we go up to my wood cutting area. Doom and despair. As I call it. Run through Creeper Mountain as I've nicknamed it because uh I swear every time I come by here, like for whatever reason there seems to be creepers that just randomly spawn in this bush. So anyways, we go over here. And you'll notice a lot of saplings. This is basically the forest I keep clear cutting whenever I need wood. And there's the wood cutting place that I built a long time ago. And I've actually been using it. Oh, have I ever been using it? Hey, look, wood. We're saved. Hooray. I think that should be enough wood to finish this build. And probably finish the lumber yard. So as you can see, I've clearly prepared. I never go into stuff unprepared generally. Because that's kind of stupid. I should probably make a path. Not go straight to there, but uh... Never really have. I mean, literally, I just need to extend this path going the other way, but, uh... uh at some point, I'll have to do it. Because it's just going to get incredibly inefficient to have to go through the desert first. It's just extra detour. Really is. go. I'll just throw the rest there. Why not? So now we have basically what is going to be the shape of our house. I was wondering if I should put a column there. I think I might. There you go. I think it'd look better if I did that. Personal opinions, once again, they always fly out in this series. So, this is going to be a very simple wall to build. We just need to literally just uh, do this. There you go. We've already isolated the two shops. As you can see, it's going to be... The problem is if I do a roof overhang for these shops, it's going to touch the library. And that's going to be kind of a problem. And I have a shovel out. And I have an axe. And now I'm doing stuff right. And... More wood time. Uh, that should be good enough. And... There you go. So far, so good. It's working out. Love it when stuff works. How am I going to do windows on this side if I'm going to do one? If I'm going to do it, I'm just going to do a small one here. Yeah, it would make most sense to me anyway. Oh boy. More wood. So was more wood with me. At least for this village. It's going to be a real pain in the ass is where I start building with sand. Because then I just got to completely butcher the landscape to get enough sand. It's going to be terribly hard to do. Not entirely sure how I'm going to do it. 
Hmm. I think I'll, that is solid back for now. And I need to sleep. Hey, look, it's the doghouse. I need a dream shot through a bunch of like stupid dirt and shit in that chest. <laughs> so that's just a chest filled with dirt and stuff. For no real reason, other than I needed the space to carry everything I was going to need for this episode. Kind of really terrible, but uh, whatever. Needed to be done. I much like the air house, I don't think this one's going to have a back either. Well, this one, there's a tree in the way, so. You know, if I did a back on the air one, it would just look weird. Considering this one's not going to have one. I'll just leave that log up there. I don't even care. This one's got a tree in the way, too. Ah. Oh, what a stupid tree. That's still in the way. Oh, it'll move. Trust me, it will move. We'll have to move. Stupid tree. Now I throw a window there, but it's gonna look stupid. So I guess this one will have a back window. Oh wait, though, no, there's a tree in the way. It won't have a back window. This one's gonna be kind of a weirder. Yeah, I guess I'll just fill that one in. Now they're identical. Now thing is, I'm not sure where I'm going to go for the stairs, but I'm thinking against this inside wall here would be my best bet. I'm going to do like a bedroom thing. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to create like a counter here. Yeah, because the store is going to need a counter anyway. Now yeah, this top bar here. This is all going to be ceiling. So I might as well just take care of that right now. So, basically we're playing fill in the blanks. And where is the... I think I'll throw it in this corner. That makes sense to me. Yeah, because I can throw a staircase going up a... Uh, in this general area. So I put that there. So far, so good. Okay, so about that. I'll just fill this in, why not? I might dig this out and throw a couple ovens in here. Since I think this is the wool leather. I'm pretty sure it says wool and leather here, so I'm just gonna cut out a place for. I don't know. Maybe a couple ovens for the hell of it. Because everyone's gonna have ovens too. So it doesn't really matter, but. Okay, so there's that pile of wood going. Also gonna need some stairs, but. I think I only need four stairs anyway, so. Let's count the amount of stairs we need. One, two, three, and four. Assuming I can get this one to stay up right. There you go. That's all the stairs I need. Now for lighting, I'm just gonna throw these two torches on the back wall. And these two here. There you go. Grab my trap door, as usual. Right there. There you go. You have a way to get beyond the counter very easily. Two furnaces. Right there. Right under the stairs. Makes sense to me. Don't have any extra crafting tables, but I can easily build them should the need ever arise. I'm going to need more furnaces too, so I'm going to need to go back down to my quarry area and grab more stone because I'm stupid and really think about furnaces when I did this. So we'll go do that right now. 
I might also just grab the stuff I need for beds. There you go. Grab my bed supplies too. Why not? For each it's enough for four furnaces. And four furnaces. And back to where we were. Yep, we are over an hour now. And so far we basically got well, even though this is kind of one building, it's technically being built as two. I still need to put the sign on my other thing too now I think about it, but I'll worry about that layer. Four. As usual, we're going to need to divide here. And we're going to have the opening there. And the rest is just filling in the roof. Very, very simple designs. Nothing complex. These are basically complete mirror images of each other. So, like I said, nothing insanely complicated here. There's no crazy circles really being thrown into it yet. Which I really should build more of circles, but for this village, just winter village, I don't think circles would work for the design I'm going for. So I'm not going to play with circles at all, really. Well, I might for a layer build, because I was thinking last night while I was going over this to make sure I had everything ready, that I should possibly do something that I hadn't originally considered. But, uh... That would completely add probably like another whole other two sessions at least to finish it. And my idea anyway, so I'm going to tell you guys right now, since it doesn't really matter since I'm mostly going to be done this village after today, is I wanted to do a guard station up there where that path goes towards the desert. And I wanted to do one towards where this passageway through the mountain is. But, uh... That would probably require some redstone for the one near the mountain, because I want to do like a gate there. Like kind of like a checkpoint gate, kind of. And for the desert one, I just kind of want to have an outpost. So, uh, you know, that kind of stuff. I'll just uh, start with the walls up here, I guess. Now, these aren't exactly going to be massive rooms, so... I'm not too worried about the... Uh, size being a huge factor. Now, to make up for the black windows on the back and sides, I'm going to have them come into play over here. And I'm just going to have to build a wall up here. Now, I should not have blocked the socks. I'm, you know, dumb, as usual. Hmm. There's really nothing to see out the front, so. See, these two windows here should be completely fine. I think that'll be good. Personal opinions. I think that's enough of you guys hearing about me and personal opinions. Because I've used that line how many times this episode? Like three, four, something around there. Let's see. I think I'm going to build this one to be like four ish high. Hmm. I'm at three right now. If I build four, yeah, the roof will be touching, but it won't be touching very much if I build it one higher. So there. 
We'll end up doing that. And I'll still end up short in this building by a little bit, but that's completely fine. That's the way it probably should be. And we still need to shave this entire stupid thing. I'll just do that because I'm a jackass and hate trees. That sun is going down. Oh, lost piece of meat. I'll have to go grab some more food. Which actually, I know where there is food, so I should probably go grab it. All the way back over at my fishing supplies thing. Grab a, probably about half the fish that are in here. That I fished for like absolutely no reason. I'll just use those as my food. Even though fish don't heal very much, uh, I need to eat something. So yeah, basically once I finish this 